You remembering that time I put on way too much highlight and thought I looked amazing. Oh no, I'm scared. I win this trend. Oh, you didn't. <gasps> oh my god. No. No. At first I was like, it's it's a bit much, not that bad. Second image video thing. I'm like, okay, mm, like a little much. Third, whoa. Natural lighting exposed it all. Looks terrible. It looked like white face paint. You, it didn't even highlight. It was not a highlighter at that point. It was paint. Guys won't even understand what highlighter is, but like we can all tell that that did not look good. <laughs> Gabe the waiter was giving me a hug from everyone. Okay, hold on. Let me read this for everyone because I was just like blah, blah, blah. thinking about the time when I thought the waiter was giving me a hug for my birthday, but he was just grabbing the candle. All right. Just wish things would get better. I'm trying <gasps> to get rid of them, but nothing seems. To oh. <laughs> I was so confused when I read it. I'm like, how do you mistake someone for hugging you? That's how. You know what though? His other hand kind of did like a little pat on the back in a sense, so it kind of looked like he was going for a hug, but he was just grabbing the candle. That's okay. You gave him a hug. <laughs> that would be very embarrassing though. I think watching the video back sorry, would be more embarrassing than like the moment. Cause like she didn't really realize until probably her friend was like, bro, I don't think you realize what just happened. <laughs> oh my God. Is he okay? Oh my God. I feel like you would break your nose from that. That was like a hard, and he went face first, or his chin, I'm not really sure. <laughs> but what I really want to know is what video were you about to film that you need like water and you're crawling on the car? Is that the type of video you were about to film? Thinking about the time I tried to write a country soul diss track towards all my old private school classmates. You know how you can see someone and tell that they're a Take those people's faces and have them all by ten. They acting all high dollar with their two thousand followers, but they couldn't be hollower. Uh, they're all the same. <laughs> no! Oh my god! I'm not trying to say he's not a good singer. <laughs> but that was so bad. The singing wasn't great, my friend. Uh, the lyrics. Not great. The music. <laughs> it kind of sounded like a circus track, like the piano. Um, but you know what I appreciated the first line. You know when you're looking at someone's face and you can tell that they're a beep. <laughs> I, I do know. Yes, I look at her every day in the mirror. I would never date a demon slash dragon. Ah! Huh? It's her. Are you calling yourself a dragon? I mean, I'm not, I was, I should be concerned about the demon part. I'm really just more concerned and confused about the dragon part. That's scary. Did he tattoo his eyes or are those um, contacts? Cause I have seen the stories of where you tattoo the white parts of your eyes or your pupils. Can you even do that? You can tattoo the white parts, but what about like the actual pupil? I feel like there's gotta be contacts and a tattoo maybe. I don't know. Why, why am I trying to figure it out? It doesn't matter. It's just there. Also, I still wouldn't date the demon slash dragon. Guess what this effect is? Yes. Um, clear skin? Clear skin. Yeah, something like that. Why, what is it? Oh, I was like trying to figure, I thought this was just like a screen recording and like somebody's getting a pop-up, but no, that's like a filter. Oh, I will say like, I'm not really the greatest fan of like these pretending to be cheating things because like that kind of sucks. That, that would make the other person really feel bad. Like even though you're like, oh, I'm just kidding. I don't know, like in the moment, that doesn't really seem like a very nice prank, but like go off, I guess. Do what you will. If things crash and burn, that is on you, baby. Ooh, what's this gonna be? Tomorrow it's gonna be on display. So <gasps> you! Oh! Well, 
he lost his job that day. That is why you leave it to the professionals. I honestly would not even carry one of these. If someone was like, hey, can you carry that over to, no. No, I can't have that responsibility on me because I knew that if I dropped it, I am carrying the weight of that fail. And I can't handle that. Oh, this is, oh, that's, oh, it worked. Nope. I got a little bravery. Oh, I love this. Oh! Okay, I was so impressed. I was like, wow, it worked. Oh, I liked his little voice. I'm not making fun of his accent. Anytime I do an accent, guys, like you're making fun of his accent. No, I'm not. I like it, and I wish I had it. So I'm imitating it because I want it. Now I got a little bravery. I love it. I just want a fun accent. Being Canadian's boring. Also, I think we all knew that that wasn't going to work. I was slightly surprised at first. I was like, hmm, but a little more swing and a little more hop. Done. <gasps> Stop! What's that girl doing with her mouth? Oh. <laughs> no! What is she doing? <laughs> First of all, are they in a club or something? Is it legal to have a two-way mirror in a place like that? I feel like that's not legal. That's kind of, I don't know, maybe it is, but I feel like that's a little bit creepy. And whatever you're doing with your mouth is just as creepy and weird and it kind of looks like you're on something and you're hallucinating a little bit. I hate when people be like, you're so fine, you're too fine, like this and that. Like, okay, they come over here and get railed oh! or quit the cap. Oh, I hate when people- Ixu. Huh? Huh? Oh, stop it now. Oh, I didn't know where that was going. Wow, that was freaking magical. You got some guts to grab that video, find him on Facebook, find his mother or father. I couldn't really tell, I think mother. Send it to them, be like, yo, this is your son. Oh man, some people are so clever. I wish I had the balls to do that. Cause that was Quinn. Some people are like, you're too fine. You're too hot. Like pipe down, pipe down. Who's saying that? Anyways. Hiding under the bed and scaring my bestie prank. If my friend tried to do that to me, I would be throwing hands so fast, so fast. Roomies, if you're watching this, which you probably are not, but if you are, try this and see what happens, all right? I dare you. I dare you. I know I'm not the type of person to be like, square up with me, but it just takes that one time, okay? Fool me once, strike one. Don't be grabbing my leg like that. I would fight. If I was this person, I would be like, okay, we're fighting this. Catch me outside. How about that? I'm not, no, 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 no. I don't mess with that. No way. No way. That is how you ruin friendships. Try and give me a heart attack, see what happens. Right there. This on top of that, right there. Right, let's go. Hey mom. I need to talk to you. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my goodness. Why would you do that to your own mother? She birthed you. She brought you into this world and she can take you out just as quick. Oh my goodness. If I tried that to my mom, I know I'm an adult, but she would still try and ground me anyway. She'd be like, go to your room. And I'd be like, okay, hold up. I need to drive back. I'll stay in there. I promise. Sorry, mom. I'm remembering the time I spent two years trying to get on the show Wipeout and then was literally the worst. <gasps> you were on there? This is Jersey native Jason Balinskis. He studied the tape. He's trained for this moment. He's ready. Oh, God. <laughs> 
where he's oh, freaking no. out and getting time penalties for going under the top. And his dream is oh, he's so not doing well. well. At least his preparation on the playground really That was their training? Climbing the ladder. That skill's going to help in the splaticombs where balance is... Uh, oh, no! Oh. He is coming in with the worst time of the day. When he said training, I definitely didn't think he meant climbing a jungle gym for preschoolers at the park. I don't think that's quite the training that it takes to be successful at Wipeout, but hey, you know what? You tried, you went on the show, and uh, you conquered a dream at least. Like, you got on the show. That's pretty impressive, my dude. Let's go. Here, you gotta chop. Yeah. What's that smell? Jump off you, man. You smell really good today. Yeah, I know. Thanks. Wait, I didn't put any perfume on. <gasps> Hello. Babe, it's your, it's, your, it's your perfume. Are you wearing that? No. Why oh, would I wear perfume? <laughs> Who's been in here then? Only you, babe. Can't be. Oh. It's only been you. Oh. It can't be me. It's only been Who's you. Who's been in here? Only you. <gasps> nah, I just paid some perfume. I love how she wasn't really buying it the whole time. Like, there was that split second, I was like, wait a second, like, it's not you, if it's not me, then who is it? And she could have gone to that dark place, it's like, oh, you've been cheating on me, ah, ah. but like, no, she didn't. She was like, nah, I know he's joking. That's cute though. I mean, I, would, I wouldn't really like it if somebody did that to me because I'm a very paranoid person. I'd be like, you're leaving me, don't leave me, but like, Watching it is okay. Experiencing it though, that's a very, that's a different story. Please don't do that to me. Please, don't leave me. Don't leave me. Please, I just wanna be loved. <laughs> the comments are gonna be like, oh my God, I love you. Like, please don't. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> love you guys, but like, I'm good. <laughs> I just got a text from my ex. <gasps> Which one? Which one? You know who. Oh my gosh, you think after five years of marriage she'd stop texting you? What does he say? Happy Thanksgiving? Um, not exactly. Oh. What's the tea? <sighs> Tell him your turkeys are <gasps> Jordan! Whoa, Jordan! Jordan, that was spicy! Jordan, you gotta reel that in a little bit. Nobody was ready for that one. Damn, coming in hot with the quips. Somebody sign this man up for stand up. I pay <laughs> Oh no, come on, man. <laughs> Figure it out. <laughs> oh, I just want to go down and do a forehand. You just have to turn it. <laughs> Bro. I love that he's just watching and filming and laughing. This reminds me of math class in high school when you had to like, you had to figure that out, like how to turn a certain thing. I feel like it can be harder than it looks sometimes, but this, like all you have to do is flip it a certain amount of times and you'll eventually get it, man. Oh my God. I feel like if that happened to me, I would have an actual heart attack. I would I would collapse to the ground before the bomb hit me. Information of a possible nuclear strike against this country has been received. No, this is this is a big deal. They don't do this. It's that they've been fired. Oh my god. No way. No way. I know that this was a prank. Watching this video, I know this is a prank and still my heart is in my ass right now. I, I'm scared for them. Even though this isn't real. If you pull that prank on me, we're no longer friends. Again, I'm a very nervous person. Okay, anything that goes slightly left, I can't handle that. That, whoa, that really freaked me out. Oh my goodness. I could not imagine getting pranked like that. That's disrespect. Oh no, not the bugs. Not the bugs. Oh my goodness. <laughs> me too. <laughs> I 
crying, I think. Yeah, the crying, like the relief crying, like, oh my God, it's not real. Oh my God, imagine if it wasn't a sticker. Imagine you see a bug that big, dude. I mean, that they probably have those like in Australia or something, I don't know. But like, if that was my house and that was there was a bug that big, I would be burning that place to the ground. All right, I'm out, I'm moving to the Arctic Circle where there are no bugs, I'm burning my house down and you will never see me again. I don't play when it comes to bugs. However, I have been known to squish a couple of spiders with my hand, my bare hand, on under the influence. Because at that point, I am mightier than the bug and I will just smack that thing into the wall. Get my chancla and just <sighs> If you need me to kill a spider, wait for me to have a little wine first. And then, I got you. How are you tonight? Good, how are you? I'm great. -y. Okay, can I do two separate orders? This is gonna please? be a prank or something. Man. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Wait, I'm gay. I'm a gay male. I'm a gay male. <laughs> yes, ma'am, what would you like? <laughs> oh, that's so good. And you know what? I'm just. I'm happy that everyone's laughing that off because I know in today's day and age, you know, if you use wrong pronouns or things like that, people can get very upset by it. Um, and obviously this person can't see them. They're just going by voice and they thought they were a female and he's like, I'm a gay male, but they're all laughing and I like that because it wasn't serious. Oh, that's hilarious. Aw, <laughs> that's a mean prank to play on your mom. Cause like we know, like parents, you know, if anything happens to their child, they're gonna come running. So at least my mother would. Even if I like stubbed my toe, she'd be like, we need to go to the hospital. And I'd be like, it's fine, mom. We're good. Everybody stay calm. What's the Everybody procedure, everyone? Calm. What's the procedure? Stay calm. So like, I don't know. Watching this, I just thought of my own mom. Like if, if I played this prank on her, she would like, die. She'd be like, my baby. And I'd be like, I'm fine. I'm good. Don't worry about it. Sorry. Don't ground me, please. Put your food down. I'm going to try something. We have this string. You see it? You see it? Okay. We're putting it through your ear. Out the other. It's in between your ears right now. I want you to grab the right side. Grab it. Hold on to it. And you can yank it as hard as you can. <laughs> I mean, this is so fake. Because you can't be like, yeah, I see the string. Mm -hmm, yep. And then, oh, let me grab the string. Yep, mm -hmm. like he's not he's not paying attention. He's trying to yes and not paying attention whatsoever. Like, oh no, you slapped me in the face. Like, no, that was premeditated. We knew what was going on, okay? You're not fooling anybody. You got me. Oh, you really fooled me, Kev. <laughs> but I guess you can try that prank on somebody. I don't think it's gonna work, but like, there's no harm in trying. What? Hey guys, what's up, Uh, okay. Happy Valentine's Day. Did you make this? Candy apple just for you. Sean, you're so sweetie. Can I eat it? Uh, yeah. No, you have to stare at it. What? Wow, that was a big bite. How is it? Well, good. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. It was supposed to be a prank. It's an onion. Prank's on you. I love it. Oh my god. Happy Valentine's Day. Yeah, sure. Okay, first of all, ew. Second of all, staged as hell. <laughs> staged as hell. You can't be like, oh my God, like that's so nice of you. Oh my God, can I eat it? Like, no, you're gonna put it on your desk and you're gonna stare at it for the rest of your life. Damn! Of course, somebody's handing you a plate of food. They're not just gonna be like, hold this forever. No, no, I don't, I'm not buying it. I'm not buying it. I saw right through your little pranky prank there, okay? Completely made up, completely staged. You wrote the script for it. I see you, okay? You can't fool this one. No way, sharp. Dad, can you come crack my back? Oh my god. I love this guy's pranks. Oh! <laughs> oh, I love how the mom always comes running. Every time. Every time. I will say though, like this guy plays so many pranks on his family that like they should see it coming by now. Like <laughs> they haven't been conditioned to expect the unexpected, then I don't know if they ever will. Cause he still he stays pulling pranks. Like it's I guess it's never a dull moment in their house. My goodness. It must get exhausting after a while, don't you think? Oh, <laughs> oh my god. 
god. Oh, the sound of that though. Like I could feel the headache to come. She really didn't give herself enough room for that though. I feel like when you're gonna be booty popping and twerking, you need, you need space. I'm not gonna demonstrate, but I feel like you need more space than this. What's happening? Oh. oh no. Oh my God, everyone on his team right now is probably so mad. That's what happens when you get all cocky and confident with your moves. I've seen people do it in soccer. I used to play, like not professionally by any means, but people get really like all cocky with their moves. It's like, just kick the ball, just kick it. It would have went in if you just kicked it the first time, instead of trying to do these like magic tricks. Did my makeup horrible to see my boyfriend's reaction? I tried really hard today. You're pretty. You can't. Uh, you look beautiful. Like that looks beautiful. Like I uh, know you do. You look beautiful. Like it really does. It looks Aww. great. Like, yeah, you did a great job. Oh, ow! Whoa! This video just called me out so hard for me. So so alone. Ow! Ow! The. My heart can't handle it. My heart. Oh, that's too cute. That's too cute. Ow. <laughs> I don't even know what to say to that. That's just like, man. Today I'm really just getting hit in the feels with these videos. What's going on? Why am I feeling? That's not very emo of me. It's supposed to be just stone cold. What is this thing called feeling? It's supposed to be the Grinch. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> Is she drunk? You're crazy! Escalators are so dangerous. I don't care what anyone says. I still have this crippling anxiety and fear when you're coming near the end of that, and I just feel like it's gonna like my shoelace is gonna get sucked in my foot, and then I'm just gonna crumple and get shredded into spaghetti. Very stressful. I can't believe we're running down that. With a hope Oh my god, that scared me. Oh my god, I actually jumped. That scared the living hell out of me. I can only imagine being her. Oh, poor girl. She had a lovely voice too. Like she really did. And I feel like she was gonna like really give it in that course and hit that note. I'm so sorry. Mm, pizza. Oh, I could go for pizza. <gasps> oh. 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 My heart. I actually like that hurts me. Like I feel so bad. You can see that he's sorry. He feels awful. He just sit there like he just contemplated his whole career. His whole job, his career, his future, his life. In that moment, he just looked up to the sky and was like, oh, like, why? What am I doing here? That's so sad. He was apologetic and she was, seemed okay. She's like, it's okay, it's okay. Oh, my heart, it's okay, man. We drop things. We drop things. It happens. Oh, don't you do it. <laughs> nope. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you. Mm, that is instant karma, baby. I have never seen instant karma more than that. So you go like this, and you go like this. Oh. Oh, oh my. Oh my God. That was the most painful thing I feel like I've ever witnessed on someone. That was way harder than that guy on the car. Oh my God, girl, your forehead? Oh, you're gonna have a goose egg like crazy. 
I don't even know what she was trying to do. I feel like she's trying to flip her hair over because us girls do that. We flip our hair over to like style it. I don't think you should be doing tutorials from here on out. All right, so I'm here with my mom and we're gonna play a game. Oh my God, Brent Rivera. Okay, so what sound does a cat make? Um, meow. Meow. What sound does a dog make? Okay. Um, what sound does a pig make? Yeah. Um, what sound does a whale make? Are you? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I kind of saw that one coming. It's a good prank though. It's not one of those toxic pranks. So like, you know, I approve. I, it, it, is, it has been Brie approved. So like, if you want to play this prank on your mom, just don't do it on Christmas because she might fight you. But like, any other day, go ahead. I want to see what happens. Send me a reaction. I just had this um, mac and cheese in a cup, you know, just the regular. And I looked at the bottom and there's actually an expiration date and it says the 24th of February, 2020. Uh -huh. Aww. Uh huh. If it didn't taste bad, maybe it it's probably fine. I don't know, okay, hang on. Jump into a, jump into <gasps> chat and uh, tell Cameron what to do before she does a food poisoning. I forgot that was on mute. I was telling my mom, but you guys can do that too. <laughs> Oh my god, I was so confused at first. I was like, I don't see the problem. If you if you know you ate it, it's fine. <gasps> she was filming a TikTok and she was on a live like Zoom call. Girl. I gotta give it to her though. That was a smooth save in transition. It'd be like, oh, I was just telling my mom. Didn't want to embarrass herself and say I was filming a TikTok. <gasps> what the <laughs> that, that circus music is the best part. Is he sleeping or is he drunk or is it both? Because he was a full out, like he noodled that. He was as flimsy as a spaghetti noodle when he went down. I feel like that's not just a regular sleep. He was out cold. What? <gasps> You're crazy. I'm just finally making him commit, you know? Like, we're getting married now, or like, it's over. Woo! Do it! Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh my god. Did someone have told me that? Yo, this is why. Girls have the reputation of being crazy. It is girls like this. Do not say yes. You say yes, you are signing up for a world of crazy, my man. That is, that is some, that's nuts. That's insane. Would you do it, Chris? Come on. No way is anyone in this world waltzing up to me like that and demanding I marry them in the middle of a freaking Target while I'm working. You're crazy. Hi, Charlie. Charlie? Melio? Congratulations oh, on your 100 million. Thank you. What do you have to say to your fans? Oh, how beautiful um, you are. Just thank you. Who gives a Oh, aye, aye. Charlie, how are you feeling about it? We all care. I mean, is he wrong? <laughs> I was going to say, he kind of has a point. I, I don't, I like Charlie D'Amelio, whatever. She's like 16. She's cute, but like, do people care? Not really. I mean, her fans care, obviously, but like in the real world, do we care? No. I was unfazed when she had 100 million or whatever it was. She renegated her way to 100 million. I was like, good for you. You're doing amazing, sweetie. Good for you. Can't relate. <laughs> uh, so this old lady had the nerve to ask me if this is my disability card. This. I wonder if this is enough. Hmm? Oh, no. Let's go see her face <laughs> when she finds out I've got one leg. Excuse me, do you not approach me because I don't look disabled enough? No, no, no. No? Because no. no. he, he came up to me let and let said me if I had a... Let me tell you. Why? I will tell you why. Why? Because I actually desperately need it. 
and they have been called. It is a place. I've got place. one leg, and you come up to me asking me if I've, if I'm if this card oh is mine, God. if this disability card is mine. I do. Oh, that's bad. That is very bad. That's. Well, I would never go up to someone and say, like, are you disabled? Are you disabled enough? Disabled enough? Like, that's the worst part. Is like, are, do you desperately need it? What? This man has one leg. One leg. It doesn't get any worse oh than that. God. Like, he just, he's missing a limb. Literally. Oh my god. I bet she felt enough? stupid. Like, baby, just because you're old doesn't mean you need a disability card. Okay. She can probably walk better than he can. Probably. If she has both her legs and she's just, right? just chilling. She's good. Count your blessings, lady. You have two legs. Yeah. Oh boy, uh, she had to do a little extra and then she just got a little extra. That'd be kind of embarrassing. I really don't know if it would be embarrassing or not if I'm being honest with you guys. I feel like I guess it is. I don't know. I feel like I don't get embarrassed by most things that other people would get embarrassed by. So like, I genuinely don't know, but I guess that'd be embarrassing. What is happening guys? Welcome back to Top 10 Central. I don't know why I did it like that. See guys, I don't get embarrassed. I could do a little mustache wipe while I introduce myself and still not care. A Snellville police officer is now at the center of controversy tonight over a TikTok video he posted. Oh. In it, he's seen in his patrol car joking about a woman giving birth in the back seat while she's in custody. Critics, however, say this is no laughing matter and they think he should face some serious consequences. Oh, I love the way it literally cut to a new, like a, a, a new, new story. It really, it, like people are taking it this seriously. I mean, if it was a real situation, yeah. If obviously if there's a woman giving birth in the back of it, and he's like, "No, I'm not gonna yeah. help you." Different. That's a joke. People are so sensitive, y'all, in this year. I hope you guys get less offended in 2022. There's no chance of that happening. It's no, just gonna get worse. It's gonna get worse. It is downhill from here. I miss the days when people didn't get us offended. I miss 2019. Like that was funny <laughs> TikTok. I didn't take it seriously. I think he would help a woman if she was giving birth. Yeah, I, I would hope so. Unless he's like recounting a story. In that case, like, sir. He'd probably have a lawsuit against him. Though. Oh, for sure. <laughs> but you know, you never know. People, people are weird. True. I want to hear it again. Why did you cheat on me? Just tell me. I already told you why. I know, but I want to hear it again. Yes. No, chill out, Owen. Tell me why. Because after you had him, you were giving him all the attention. So every time I went to work, a girl at work was giving me all the attention. So that's why I did it. Okay, you realize that I was taking care of our son, right? I was taking care of our son. So you cheated oh on me God. because I was giving our son all the attention. And you go to work and find attention elsewhere? Do you know what an ass you sound like? You sound completely pathetic. That's why I'm not yes. letting you back in the house. That's exactly why. I love her. I really love her. How are you gonna have a whole child and be like, mm, but I wanna be the center of attention. Like you were giving our baby the attention? That's what your excuse is for cheating? Are you kidding me? Like the kid can't feed itself. <laughs> Even that though, who gives a f That's what a good mother does. They give a baby attention. That, that, I mean, it's kind of a thing. Like, it's so crazy that that's the, I was hoping for a better excuse. I really was. This looks wild. These are sand dunes, I think they're called. So cool. Oh boy, okay. Oh, that would probably hurt a lot. You get like scraped from the sand. I don't think you'd break bones, but like you'd feel that one in the morning, ain't I right? <laughs> Have a few drinks after that one, you know, and still still feel the pain, right? I don't know. I'm making, I'm trying to make jokes here, and they're just not landing, even for me. But my own jokes aren't making me laugh, so you know something's wrong here, folks. So I work at a bakery, and last night a man came in, and he was like, "Hey, do you have any caramel cakes?" And I was like, "Yeah," and I showed him our caramel mousse cake, and he goes, "Perfect." She hates caramel, and obviously I'm intrigued. What? I'm like, "Okay," so I get the cake. <laughs> He's like, "Could you write something on it?" And I'm like, "Of course I can." And he's like, "Would you mind writing?" Good riddance. And he goes, oh, and can you also, can you just make it really girly, like put a bunch of hearts on it, just make it really oh nice. What's this for? What you want in mind? I'm like, it says good riddance, you want a really nice, whatever. He goes, my girlfriend cheated on me last night. I'm getting a cake to break. <gasps> if you don't believe me. Oh, here's I the love cake. it. But it's beautiful. This right here is my life's worth. I love it. I know it's not gonna get better than <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I love her. She's peaked. <laughs> 
She's funny. You're at your the prime of your career right oh now. Oh my god, a breakup cake. I mean, I wish I could be broken up with with a cake. Honestly, but I don't think he, he probably didn't actually give her the cake. Like he showed her, but then he's like, "But I want. I paid for that cake. Like I wouldn't give that cake away but, to a cheater." I mean, if it was like, I mean, that's a masterpiece. Like so you made a caramel cake. You know, like that's delicious. I'm not giving that up. Caramel mousse cake with beautiful decorations. At on least it? cut yourself a piece. Yeah. Before giving it to the cheater, you know. Since everybody's sharing what they got their significant other for Valentine's Day, I thought I'd share mine. What is that? Styrofoam? So, I got my husband this cute little box, filled it with pictures, of all the girls' photos that he's been liking on Instagram. Stop. Hope he likes it. Wow. Honestly, that. I don't that is kind of petty. Like, I was gonna say, does it not seem like it just shows like that you're very insecure more than yeah. anything? Like, I don't know. Yeah. It kind of makes you look just as like, ugh, like. I mean, just because you know. like somebody's picture doesn't really necessarily mean anything. No, and if it really bothers you, just talk to him and right. say like, this makes me feel insecure, and th like deal with that. That this. You don't. What does have this to do? Make a gift and make a TikTok. <laughs> Oh boy. There's levels to this. There are levels here because the guy knocking to be like, I wasn't trying to scare you. I was just trying to, you know, get your attention. They were going to blame them for throwing the phone. You were the one that threw the phone. That was your reaction. Why? First of all, who throws your phone behind over their shoulder when they get scared? Second of all, who throws their phone that high over the shoulder when they get scared? I'm curious as to what happened to the phone. Something about a lot of these videos of things falling off of balconies where my mind goes, where did that object go? Did it hit something? Did it hit someone? You know, like we had an incident where a girl threw a chair off of a balcony in Toronto and now she's being featured in Drake's music videos because for some reason we promote stupidity. I don't know. I, like to me, it was the dumbest thing in the world. She threw it on, on a highway where cars were driving. That if it hit a car, it 100% would have killed somebody. And for some reason in society, we're like, that's so stupid. We want to we wanna keep seeing more of you. Let's reward your stupidity. And then we wonder why people do stupid things and go viral and we're like, they're clout chasing. Yeah, because as a society, we have allowed a platform for these people to realize, wait a minute, I could do something with minimal effort, won't affect me personally in the sense that in the moment me filming this probably won't hurt me and I'll make a lot of money and get fame out of it. Why wouldn't you do that? Ow. Oh no. The tags? <gasps> wow. Oh my god, not Snapchat. I love it. Wow, she got the snap. That is so everything. savage though. Imagine coming home to that as the husband who's been cheating. All the conversations, pictures of you cheating are taped to your bags of your stuff. Like tell me that's not epic. That should be a scene in a movie. I was gonna say, that is a whole feature film right there. Oh, and Somebody I will act in it, please. Like that's, I wanna I be a part of this. I would the hell out of that one. Right? Oh yes. my goodness. I love that. All right, well, that is all the videos that we have to react to today, unfortunately. But hey, we're going into the new year. We've got yes. bigger and better things coming. Hopefully. And you better be along for the ride. Otherwise, I'm going to have to come back here and drag you back. To there you go. She'll do it. I will do it. She's no strong. Crap. I'm really not, but I will try I'll my help best. her. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Okay. Holy bald spot. That would hurt a lot too, pulling your hair out like that. Why even do the corn on the thing? I feel like that would chip your teeth. You know, I, I saw Jason Derulo happen to him, but I feel like that was fake. But still, I feel like it would chip your tooth. Bad vibes, wouldn't do it. 10 out of 10 would not recommend ever to anybody, ever. Oh, ah. We've all been there. I've never been there. I've never lifted weight that heavy that it would smash glass like that. 20 pound dumbbells can only roll so far. No, I've never broken glass like that. I don't work out very close to the mirrors that that could really happen. Probably for that reason, but I also haven't been inside of a gym for over a year because I live in Ontario. Are you? A star went to other people, you hear me? Here you stand and the get the fuck out. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Do that again, I'll kick you out myself. Oh wow, damn. Oh my God. I thought that was a security guard. I did, I did too, I've seen I, this video before and I thought it was security. I don't think it is though, when you look at the back of his shirt, it looks like it's a t-shirt. he's just a regular dude, that's Bro. just that up. Wow. Nah, but the person in the blanket that came to sit down, like that's me, like, yeah. oh, there's tea? <laughs> just, yes, let me see. Let me watch what happens. Yep, get cozy, get a snack, I wanna see what happens. I like that they thanked him though. Thank you, sir. Cause yes. it's like, they all wanted to do that and no one had the balls but him. 
So you're gonna fall through the chair or into the water. There it goes. <laughs> Boom. Yeah. I mean, come on, bro. We all knew that one was coming. I thought maybe he'd fall through the deck. He'd fall back on the deck and then through the deck. That'd be some bad news bears. But uh, yeah, that's pretty uh, pretty rough. But I mean, hey, at least you got him to Quan. So like that's, the, you know, it's worth it. Got my trusty stop watching. Here they come oh, they down the hill. On, eh? It looks like Ruben is in the lead and here yeah. comes out. And this okay, wow. But he just did a flip. I don't think he had a filter on. You guys know the filter I'm talking about? Maybe they did have a filter. When your face is like elongated, it looked like he had the filter on. Maybe he didn't. And maybe I'm just kind of being an ass. So ignore that part. The flip, that was a good flip. I'll give it to him. Could have been worse. Could have landed on his head. Could have landed on the tailbone. Could have landed on his shoulder. To a job. So she popped up on my For You page and she was saying racist and transphobic things. And then her account got taken down, but not before this video was saved. I am not gonna apologize for it. If God made you a boy, then you're a boy. If God made you a girl, then you're a girl. No. Period. There is no, no ifs, ands, or buts. Oh, no. None. Two. I'm going to say the N word if I want to say the N word. Okay. Oh. You're not gonna sit here and tell me I can't. I don't believe the N word is a racial term, and that's my beliefs. I believe okay. if you participate in activities that an N word does, then I'm gonna call you that way. Okay, so you won't be like, okay, I'm gonna say the N word, but then you don't say it. Girl, full send or no send? Yeah, that was so fake. Like, if I wanna say it, I'll say this. She goes, the N word is like, you're not even saying it. I don't Stand know. Stand by your girl, argument. I dare you. <laughs> this girl's got a lot coming her way. Well, like, good luck getting a job after that. Not only are you, like, literally racist, but also offending the LGBTQ plus community. So, offending all of the above. Every human possible. Yep. I'm straight and I'm still offended. And I'm white. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe people are out there like actually with this attitude and I, perspective. It's crazy. Honestly, she needs it's help. It's terrifying. I'll pray for her. We can leave her in 2021. Yeah, girl, you could go back to 2020. Yeah. Just you're you not allowed in 2022. Bye. <laughs> I saw this on Sports Center's TS TSN Instagram. I know what the epic ending is. I already know what happens. You ready? Boom. Right on him. Which I wanted to watch that a couple times. So I'm like, I feel like that could break his arm. Maybe not, I don't know. But like, it depends how heavy the thing is. I guess it could be one of those like light hollow metal things, but that would on the arm, that would hurt a lot. Then again, this other guy took a bowling ball to the foot, the bare foot. There was another one where I think the guy took the bowling ball. They like tried to drop kick it and it somehow got, it hit him in the, in the groin which would hurt a lot, but I could not imagine what it's like to kick a bowling ball. That would just hurt a lot. It'd be like kicking a rock, which I also feel like isn't fun. I've kicked hard things before, it hurts, as it should, because when hard things hit hard things, usually things break. That's probably what happened here. <laughs> wait till the end, all right, I'll wait. I, was, I wasn't going to, but now I will. I'll wait till the end now. The cat it's cat going to knock something over. Oh boy, oh, okay, all right, yep. That's the worst, that's the worst feeling. Say like when you drink too much of your beer and you put your lips over the whole bottle top and then it starts to foam up and you gotta do like a, we try to like get on top of it, you're like, it's like, I see this water bottle's way too big, but it's like it foams up and you're just like, and you're trying to capture all the foam. Guess what, you're not gonna do it. It's science, baby. All right, as I like to say on IO, science! Let's, let's go. Girlfriend, actually, how about you tell her? Shut up. <gasps> oh. Wow. Okay. I wasn't expecting that. That? Was... How do you hide that? I don't know. How do you hide like a whole ass relationship? Not even like one hookup. This is clearly like they're together. How do you hide that? I mean, there's a lot of people out there who have I done know. it. So I, don't I was know. gonna say, I'm asking. I'm like, people <laughs> cheat literally with like four people constantly. Yeah. But like, I just don't get how that's possible. Not one person will see you out. Like, I don't get how people yeah. do it. Man. Well, I mean, now everybody knows because it's on TikTok. <sighs> like, how are you going to expose that? Like that's a lot. You're exposing a lot of things here. There's a lot going on. There's a lot to unpack here. I want a part two in all honesty. <laughs> I need to know where they're at now. Yes. An update, please. <laughs> part two. I love taking the off, bro. <laughs> I don't understand how he fell down the stairs like that. Cause they're not that, they don't look that steep. And it's like, he was almost like, it's almost like, it was like the stairs were icy, but they don't look very icy. So I'm not really sure what happened here. If the stairs were very steep and you couldn't hold on again, I get it, but these seem very, like, not steep at all. At all. You should not be sliding down these. So, I don't know if this guy was just all oiled up. <laughs> he just oiled himself up for a nice tan and a swim. I don't really know. Oh. Oh, boy. <gasps> oh! <gasps> 
So that could have been very bad. They should have tested the strength of the log before jumping up to it. Thankfully, this didn't seem to happen. But if it did happen, where the log hit her in the head and then she was knocked unconscious underwater, could have been very bad. Thankfully, it wasn't. And it was just a little TikTok feel we all laugh about. But someone could have possibly, you know, like, you know. Next! <laughs> Keep watching. <laughs> Max, yeah. I would probably just keep walking. Like, what are you gonna do? Call the cops? Be like, hey, I broke this. Let me pay the city. Pay the city for what? They tax you for everything, anyways. They take advantage of you all the time. And then, meanwhile, all the politicians can make all the money. So, what are you gonna pay the city for? I'm just joking around, guys. Make sure you pay your taxes. Very important to uh, fund the salaries of politicians who make our lives live in hell. There we go. That's a sentence I was trying to get out. Come on, brain. It's only like. 2.30, okay, we can do this. Imagine this was like 2.30 in the morning, like, <laughs> must get content, <laughs> no sleep. TikTok's so embarrassing. It hurts. Who is messaging? Mm -mm -mm. I'm just picturing Jessica Simpson from Dukes of Hazard. <laughs> is that the type of video you were about to film? That little dance. Oh wow, she was really hot, eh? I remember that. I remember seeing it in like high school and I was like, oh my god, I wanna look like her. I still wanna look like her, but. It is a good music video. I'm not gonna watch it. Oh, <laughs> my part one was with Eamon. This is sad. Hi. Hi. I love it. I love it. She would love doing this with me. This just reminds me of something I would do when I was in like grade eight. Cause I remember me and my friends thought it'd be really funny to line up and take photos with Santa in this thing, even though it was like literally for children. And I have the picture somewhere. I took pictures with Santa. Oh, that's fast. How do you hide your bangs? I was just trying to hide my hair and I didn't even, okay. It's Target, right? I don't know, I saw red. <laughs> Canadian Tiger Target. I don't freaking know, but not all girls are like this, please. This is why they say all girls are crazy. It's you, lady, making us all look bad. I'm not crazy. A little bit. <laughs> what does it say? They didn't even go to the side of the map. Okay, not important. Come with us. Don't like, get left behind. 2021 kind of sucks. 2022, gonna be better. Manifest it. Yep. Let's go. <laughs> Positive manifestation. All right, folks, here we are back with another one. Not in focus. Speaking of embarrassing, time for... That was easy to say. A full flip, a full frontal right on the back, it's not as bad as it seems. It hurts, and the guy had some speed, but he also, you know, he jumped into it. If he didn't try to jump over him, he wouldn't have flipped. He probably would have gotten his legs taken out and fallen on top of the guy. Instead, he jumped, which then, when it, his legs were hit in the air, it gave his body that momentum to flip. Did it to himself, is all I'm gonna say. Next time, just have better eyes. <laughs> a lot of people, you know, as an actor, I'm not going after the fame. Definitely going after the money. Definitely going after, you know, like doing what I love to do the rest of my life. I'm not greedy about it, but at the end of the day, I wanna have a family. I have a certain lifestyle I wanna live. And I wanna be able to afford that lifestyle through acting. So that's why I'm pursuing that career. For other people, they could just lick a toilet seat or throw a chair off a balcony and achieve those levels of success. <laughs>